Hello, ladies and gentlemen, my name is Justin Brightop, and you're watching another episode of Justin and Camry's Epic Awesome Amazing Reviews. And guess what? On this episode, we have this amazing, awesome, trip-worthy, again, just like the first aid kit, trip-worthy travel umbrella, slim, compact, auto, open, close. So, another thing for you to stick in your car, and it is, it is a little weighty because it's all bound up in here. So, so there is some weight to it. Um, here we go, because it's so compact and everything, you know. So here we go. We got the easy transportation, uh, tote bag included, slim umbrella, small and compact, one button open and, and close, one hand operation mode, durable and lightweight, withstands strong winds. Let's go again here. Take another picture. All right. Can we do that? I think we can. Our umbrella, umbrella fabric material is 190T pond size, 21 inch uh, shaft material, metal and fiberglass, awesome. Pole material is metal, handle plastic with rubber finish, other eight rib steel frame, feedback, they want you to leave feedback, so leave feedback for them, the tripworthy.net, you can contact them at info at tripworthy.net, it is made in China. Okay. Here we go again. Did I get every side of it? I think I might have, but just in case, let's take another picture here. Okay, now what's really cool about this box, I believe, is it just slides out. There's nothing to open here, so you can easily put the umbrella back in the box and put it in your car. Which, I mean, what more can you ask, right? I mean, that's that's awesome right there. So it, it'll stay out of the way. I mean, maybe you're worried about your umbrella getting damaged or wet or something, and you can just keep it in this cardboard box as long as the cardboard box doesn't get wet, you know what I'm saying? And uh, so that's really cool because um, that's all what this is all about. It's the trip worthy brand. It's all about, you know, putting stuff in your car. So uh, let's do that. Now, we got to take us a selfie here. Let me see if I can, like, lean this. Oh, yeah, that's awesome. Okay. So now we're going to do. I actually uh, gave my uh, little, I little um, thing that holds your, your phone, you know. And I actually gave that to Cambry to use um, to do her videos. So. You know, I don't have one of those. Where's the timer mode on here? Timer. And I give her a little tiny tripod that goes with it. So, anyway, that's how she does her videos. Here we go. Um, so, there it is. Right here. Trip right. I put an umbrella. Um, I probably just take another picture because I was not smiling. That was, that was not good. So, a smile for the camera. There we go. And people are going to wonder what this is. So... I better open it up and, uh, you know, and then take another selfie with it, like maybe behind my head or something. And maybe I can stick this camera out just a little more while I'm doing this. Turn it so that the flag is out of the picture a little bit so it's just a product. Okay, so we're going to open this up and we're going to shoot it out. Whoa, hit me in the face. Okay, yeah, face master there. All right, that's an inside joke, by the way. Face master. Okay, so here we go. We're going to smile again. Here's our picture. Ready? Come on. Okay, smiling. Two, one. All right. So people give me wonder. They'd be like, man, is that an umbrella? What is that? Okay, so it's supposed to be completely and totally automatic, which it is, because look at this. It just goes right back in. I don't have to press a button to, re to, to get it to go back in. Just as one button. A lot of these umbrellas, they have. Uh, I shut that off. Um, a lot of these umbrellas have a uh, a little button up in here. You know, you got to push to uh, to get them to go back down. This one doesn't. It's just got a lot of strength, a lot of spring strength behind it. So and the other thing is, it's really small, really short, compact. So you hold about right here, and uh, here you go. Now let me tell you about this for emergencies, right? So I don't know if you got a way to stick this in the ground or something. You probably don't, but. But I'll tell you about in an emergency how this is, okay? So there are a lot of people, you know, that just, they, they get these strange ideas about the outdoors and about emergencies, and they don't really have the right things with them to be prepared. And so if you have this in your vehicle, you know, it could save your life, and, and, and that's simply because you're keeping the rain off of you. And that's, you know, you die from hypothermia because you get too wet, basically, and you don't want that to happen. It's a slow, miserable death. And and so if you've got this with you when you're walking, you know, you're in your car, it's raining, whatever, 
and you break down somewhere and you got to get out. You got this thing with you and, and at least you can maybe keep the rain off of your head. You know, it gives you some form of shelter. Uh, maybe you use the first aid kit, the, the trip worthy first aid kit and stuff is coming down. You're trying to do first aid and you need someone to hold something like this over the top of you, you know, so that, uh, so that you can keep the, the rain, the stuff out of, out of the wounds and the, the people that you're working on and this sort of thing. So now I am having a little bit of trouble putting this umbrella back or this, uh, umbrella back in the bag, which I expected to happen because I, I am not the most talented uh, human being when it comes to putting umbrellas back in bags. But there we are, and it all goes back in the box, which can go in your car, and it's still got the tag on it, which is fine. I don't care. Um, it's got a little instruction manual thing that comes with it. Where did the, the box shot off because of the umbrella popping out? So, Anyways, I, I like this product for Mercy. It's simple, it's compact, it doesn't take up space in your trunk. That's what I love about it. I mean, I could I could get away with putting this beside my car battery. However, you know, maybe some acid would leak on it. Because I've got a car battery in my trunk, you know, um, for reasons. But anyway, um, so yeah, awesome product. Make sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe. And if you haven't already, please check out our Patreon. We need your help. Um, we're trying to do a fundraiser because, like you see right now, this video is in, what, 1080p? And you're not seeing it in 4K. A lot of people want to see the videos in 4K. We need a better uh, video studio. And here, uh, the, the ceiling is, like, coming apart. The uh, the roof above me needs, like, a new roof. It basically, I mean, I take pictures of it. It's atrocious. It's got holes all over in it. And our bathroom here needs a toilet and a tub and a... Uh, a sink and a hot water tank. We don't have any of those things in here. In fact, we don't have any plumbing working at all in this in this house where I'm I'm doing this. We have a whole separate house here to do the videos, and it needs help. We we don't we can't heat it because there's there's no insulation. I mean, we just the heating bill would be too high. Um, the outside we need like new. It needs it needs the walls inside and outside need to be redone, um, and and the whole roof needs to be re-roofed um, of this building. So. That would be great if you would do that. Also, we need our income because, see, if we got full-time income to make videos, then it really takes the stress off. Because, like, for example, I'm going to be doing uh, videos later on this summer where I'm going to be working on my car and restoring my car. And uh, I'm going to be using these products that I got in the mail um, to work on my car and stuff I got for Christmas and things that I'm, I'm going to be reviewing that I, and stuff I've already reviewed. So you're definitely going to want to see that. And... Um, in order for me, you know, to be able to do all this stuff, I need income, you know, to pay for bills, food, things like that, you know, and getting this house redone because, you know, if I'm, if I'm gonna, if I'm gonna expand, I need storage, I need storage space because I get all this stuff in the mail and I've got other people's stuff and I, I, I try to give this stuff away and get rid of it or use it. I mean, if I got a use for it, this is probably going my car or something, but I get a lot of stuff that, you know, I, I either need to sell, which is hard to do sometimes, or I need to uh, give it away as Christmas gifts or birthday gifts, and that means I got to store it. So, you know, I need somewhere to store this stuff. The other thing is, is there's always projects and things that come later on, and, and I'll use something I get in the mail for a purpose that it was never originally intended for, um, and sometimes that's the reason I'll get it. Like I'll look at a product and uh, I'll say, wow, somebody wants somebody to review this. You know, I could use that for a such and such purpose, you know, to, to do something else because I don't maybe have the money to, uh, invest in the project or I want to save some money and, and I see something that I could, I could use for an alternative use, you know, so I'll get a product for that reason. And so it's really cool. Anyways, please make sure to support um, Cambry's videos by by liking them as well. You know, she she does uh, her a really good job on her videos on my channel. I've been very impressed by her work, and I do all the video editing. In case you're curious, um, I I do all of the video editing and and uploading and all that once they're edited, and I do all the pictures and the blogs um, as far as uploading, editing, all that stuff. And we both do the Amazon reviews. But anyways, God bless you. Thanks for clicking the, the links and all that and watching the video. And God bless you. Like, comment, share, and subscribe. And ring that bell next to the subscribe button. All right.